You can download the Archeo plugin for Unity from the Unity Asset Store and add it to your Unity project. This will add a new Archeo menu under Tools that allows you to export your Unity scene to Archeo on PC or to the cloud for easier uploads to mobile devices. Your personal link code can be found in the dialog and can be copied from the console. All visible game objects and prefabs in your scene will be exported as Archeo objects. Once you export it, you can save your scene to store the element IDs for future updates. In Archeo, you can link the plugin to your device by going to the Create, Cloud and Unity tab and filling in your personal code. The available uploads can be downloaded here and once processed, the resource can be opened from the Import tab where you can place it in your scene by loading it to Origin. Your Unity scene prefabs and game objects can now be moved and edited from Archeo. You can create new geometry on your scene or block out something from scratch. You can teleport inside and keep editing your geometry using Archeo's tools or adjust objects to the units you like. You can also work with Archeo's components and work in side spaces to adjust and find the best sidelines for your scenes. You can assign special Unity materials to Archeo shapes for collider and trigger geometry, so you can quickly mass out important reference geometry to your existing scene. The best part is that you can start a meeting with the Unity scene loaded and multiple Archeo users could see and work on your same scene together from different devices. You can place Archeo props and load custom meshes to your scenes that will later be converted to game objects. You can save design options from your scene and once you're done, you can export your file back to Unity. In Unity, you can load your scene from the Archeo menu under Tools and select the latest file you want to import from the PC or Cloud. All new geometry will be imported in your active scene. The existing prefabs and game objects that have been moved or edited in Archeo will be updated to their new position. Archeo props and imported objects will be converted to new game objects with the textures and properties applied. The geometry with assigned trigger and collider materials will have a special script assigned that will hide the object on playtime and can be adjusted to your game's needs.